Hi, Larry Stewart here with FloorConstructionPros.com. Welcome to ConExpo ConAg 2020. We're in the Caterpillar North Hall booth with Mauricio Briones, who is the product application specialist for excavators in South America. Mauricio, the uh, next-gen excavators have come on wheels. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there used to be kind of a, a separation between wheeled excavators and the tracked excavators, and now we're seeing a lot of the same features on the wheeled machines. What do you think that brings? What's the, what are the most important features that that brings to the wheeled excavator line? Oh, that's perfect. Yeah, from my point of view, I think for the customer point of view, uh, he will find more commonality between both machines. He will find uh, the parts, maintenance, the technicians, the operators will be much more familiar with different families of machines. So it's very common on the job site. You have more expertise operator for tracks, another operator for wheeled. So this is a quite different and it's boring sometimes because you need to count with one specific operator for every single machine. Yeah. And when we start to do some commonality with these machines, you can, do, you can use the same operator for different models. Right. So of course for the customer it would be a huge advantage. With that, that commonality with the, the next gen excavators, you've got a new cab on here. Yeah. Uh, what does that bring to the, to the Well, table? the commonality is not, is not only on features benefits, the commonality is in parts. So what I mean is the same computer, the same seat, the same glass, uh, the same uh, bolt and nuts you will find in the track hacks, you will find in the wheel hacks. For example, not only for the operator, but for the mechanic, he will find the same air filters, the same fuel filters. So it makes the life easier. One operator can drop off from a track machine and step in the wheel hex, he will find the same computer, same configurations, same options. So much easier. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and, and uh, you know, much more availability of those parts, uh, exactly. less expensive to stock. There's a lot of really good benefits. Yeah, 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 for sure. Well, I remember in the discussions about next-gen excavators, there was some talk about changes in maintenance uh, on, on those machines. Has that been brought to the, the wheel deck? Yes, yes. Well, now we are offering less filters, less oil, because the system, the hydraulic system was improved. So it helps the maintenance as well. It reduces the cost of the maintenance as well. Mm -hmm. So basically, we used to see some hydraulic lines leaving the cab to go to the pilot system. We don't have it anymore. It's all electronics. Right, right. So make the life easier again for the mechanical. Yeah, the the, the hydraulics that have, yes. have been eliminated are all those pilot systems. That's right. Right, right, right. So it's still got the same tank hydraulic or similar tank. Similar tank. Uh, similar uh, volume. Tank. So you've got the mm -hmm. the temperature control there mm -hmm. in place. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah. So is the footprint different then with a wheeled excavator versus a tracked excavator? Perfect. Yeah, it's yeah. not, it's a, is the tracked track excavator wider? Oh, uh, yes, yeah. yes. The track excavator is a little wider, not on the upper frame, but in the broader frame. Yeah, yeah. And it depends also the size of the tracks. Okay. But basically the machine can do the same thing. Sure. Of course, in different bases and different uh, uh, capacities, mm -hmm. but the work, you can do the same work. How has uh, attachment capability changed with these new machines? Well, uh, the wheeled hex, normally the wheeled hex is, is more urban machine. It's more, is, uh, much more popular to work with work tools. So this machine comes from factory, better prepare or more prepare with hydraulic lines, extra hydraulic lines, high pressure, middle pressure, quick coupler. So this machine can work with a, a, a wide amount of work tools, very easily, changing coupler, change one hose, and done. What is the status of wheeled excavators, especially in North America? I know they're popular in Asia, popular in Europe. Um, wh what are you seeing in North America? Is there, is there an uptick in, in use of these machines, and what are they doing? Well, I used to say that uh, if somebody asked me to buy a machine, seriously, I would buy a wheeled hex. Really? Yes. Because, that surprises me. Yeah, no, <laughs> seriously, not because I work for those machines, but uh, because we have more mobility. Yeah. So we can do all the package, the whole package of applications that we have on track hacks, plus mobility. What's the comparison uh, production-wise between a track hex and a, and a wheel hex? Yeah, this is a very hard to compare on numbers because all depend off the work tool, the application, and also, we need to remember that this machine doesn't have the same stability that we have on tracks. Mm -hmm. That's why we need to use the all triggers or the blade to create more stability. Okay. So, 
this is a kind of number I don't like to manage because it's a wide different right. and you have a right. big range of numbers. But the thing you have to keep in mind is, is that over the side stability is probably lower on a machine. Perfect. Like you yes. Know, you've, got, yes. you've got to use outriggers. Exactly. Well, it sounds like a, a great package. Uh, it's good to see the, the commonality. I'm sure contractors will really appreciate that, not to mention dealers. Uh, For sure. And I wish you the best of luck with this machine mm -hmm. and uh, mm -hmm. with, with the rest of the show. Yeah, and again, I invite everybody to download the app mm -hmm. to be more familiar about our, our monitor. And also, I invite everyone to go in the internet, in all channels that we have available. There are so many videos explaining about the next gen hacks, even for tracks or for world hacks. All right, well, best of luck. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. You. you build things, things that last. That's why you surround yourself with people you can rely on. A cat dealer's name is a promise on everything we do, from helping you get into your cat to protecting, updating, and servicing it. It's our way of saying we know there's so much more riding on it than just you. Let's do the work.